नमस्कार वेलकम टू माई चैनल प्लीज कॉमेंट हाउ यू फील अबाउट माई डिस्कशन दैट आई हैव स्टार्टेड अबाउट द कैरेक्टर ऑफ द प्लैनेट सूर्य और सन एंड मून हैव ऑलरेडी बीन डिस्कस्ड टूडे आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट मार्स आफ्टर सन एंड मून मार्स एज ए प्लैनेट हैज द ग्रेटेस्ट इंफ्लुएंस ऑन आर्स सन is the agent of vitality and creation moon stores that vitality within the body mars function is to protect the body from external harmful influence that is sun is the ruler moon is the housekeeper mars is the commander and the peacekeeper protecting the body from the attack of external enemies and expelling internal enemies from within the body both are the functions of mars mars is always alert his watchful gaze roams over the whole body day and night when mars is asleep it is impossible to protect oneself from internal rebellion and external attacks mars is the agent of self preservation that is why mars is unmarried and strong handed unmarried because there is a possibility of loss of energy in wife luxury mars is the sign of energy sun's steady radiance becomes active energy in mars mars is water abounding in life force like a spirited horse simply wants to get out of the bind mars is pool of pride mars is the factor of courage the factor of valor the factor of efficiency and anger he does not know anything about fear he has no weakness it is not possible for him to walk slowly and steadily he likes to act fast then consider mars is the embodiment of freedom he wants total power total freedom even a little bond is difficult for him he is unwilling to give up even the smallest part of his rights he wants his own establishment completely it is against his nature to compromise sun is also libertarian jupiter also favors independence sun wants freedom for his own glory so he has forgiveness jupiter's freedom is based on wisdom justice rules and order as jupiter himself wants freedom he also accepts the rights of others but mars is completely selfish greedy for rights he has no regard for the rights of others mars is the form of fire in our created world he warms whomever he comes in contact with he wants to burn him its motion is not exactly one way it wants to spread like a spark of fire therefore those reformers who want to introduce new ideas and new ways the predominance of mars is seen in the horoscope of them it is for the same reason that in those over whom the influence of mars is greater there is an expression of flamboyant stubbornness mars is also worshipper of truth but there is a complete lack of consideration or tolerance in him what he knows or thinks to be true he cannot be at that to be protested he has no respect for the opinions of others the idea that there could be some truth in doctrines of others is impossible to realize for mars so if anything happens against his opinion he protests strongly and 
डिसरप्ट द अपोजिंग पार्टी विथ एटैक आफ्टर एटैक हिस्स पीस डज नॉट कम अंटिल द एडवर्सरी इज ट्रेवल्ड एंड डिस्टर्ब नेगोशिएशन इज अगेंस्ट हिज नेचर ऑल्दो मार्स मोटिव इज सेल्फ डिफेंस बट वेन ही सेट्स आउट टू डिफीट एन ओपोनेंट ही डज नॉट थिंक ऑफ पर्सनल हार्म His only goal is to destroy the opponent. He does not hesitate to die for them. All those who are famous for patriots have the predominance of Mars in their horoscope. As mentioned earlier, the function of Mars is to expel waste from the body and protect the body from external harmful influences. Therefore. life force is more pronounced in mars than in all other planets the predominance of stubbornness and instinct is especially noticeable in mars for this abundance of life mars is a unmarried and he is reluctant to accept marriage but when he is associated with planets like weak rahu or venus concupiscence is strongly expressed in him but even in that instinct his own nature remains intact here too egoism prevails and his own happiness becomes the only desire the sense of self sacrifice in intercourse that makes it superior to animal husbandry is completely absent in him this is because mars being the center of vitality invigorates and enlivens the planet or sign it associates with and increases the intensity of the results indicated by that sign or planet if the association with the sign of planet is auspicious the results are strong but not incongruous but if the relationship is inauspicious manifests in a disorderly and chaotic manner for example if mars has a good association with mercury then the native's intelligence and intellectual power inventive power writing and speaking ability etc will be well expressed but if there is an opposite relation the native will manifest perversion of intellect lying talkativeness etc mars indicates desire to express himself in action instinct for action motivation for action inclination to turn everything into action self confidence self assertion desire to fulfill instinct belief in own superiority a word needs to be said here instinct it indicated by moon the desire to commit is by mars and the desire for restraint is by saturn and ketu besides in the mental world mars indicates brilliance bravery vitality strength arrogance pride anger stubbornness freedom loving constructive power enmity with others strife oppression litigation accident organizational power arrogance sharp wit factory antidote high tempered or haughty person quick tempered proud person commander warrior peace keeper police or military officer land side house house building work materials for building a house or any building fire red color heat craftsman engineer contractor machinery and equipments with which energy is supplied electricity stream heat etc are indicated by mars but the technique of application of energy law of energy or science are indicated by venus 
Mercury indicates the general method of application of energy. Therefore, it can be said that Mars is only porter, skilled worker in conjunction with Mercury and in association of Venus or by well placed and well conjoined or expected Rahu, it will be engineer. A Mars native will be very dynamic and will always be active. They do not particularly like working under other. Their physical abilities will be very good. Nothing terrible can be seen in them. They never back down and it is almost impossible to surprise them to fight directly. It is possible to subdue them only with sweet words. The native of real and proper Mars will be the symbol of gallant semen. But if Mars is badly placed and expected by a malefic planet and is not associated with a benefic planet, the native will be like demon or brute in nature. However, what is meant by criminal, the native of Mars cannot be like that. It is possible to meet their needs and demands fairly. They usually do not commit crimes. The native of Mars will be of medium height. The body will be muscular and handsome. The tone of voice will be commanding. He would become angry if his orders were disobeyed in any way. There will be a great personality in movement, etc. Common people will accept him as a leader because of his fierce personality and power to tear apart. The native never resort to subtlety, diplomacy or subterfuge. Always tries to resolve conflict by speaking directly and clearly. Their ability and power to break is so high that they are able to easily reach the fixed goal at any stage. Many people try to improve their luck by using this native. However, if the Mars is badly placed, associated with malefic and expected by malefic, then the native become fearful in nature. They are completely heartless, flawless and of praise the weak. It is possible for them to commit any kind of sin. A native of true auspicious marks is always appreciated and is regarded as a symbol of courage. Under the good influence of Mars, the native can become a good sportsman. Any sports or physical activity are indicated by Mars. This was my discussion today. Please comment how are you feeling about my discussion and subscribe the channel if you have not done already. Hope that everyone will be fine. Namaskar.